I'm going to talk to you this evening on the subject of the spectrum of love. We know that from time to time there arise among human beings people who seem to exude love as naturally as the sun gives out heat. People who exude love are apt to give things away. Uh, they are uh, in every way like rivers, they stream. And so when they collect possessions and things that they like, they are apt to give them to other people because uh, when you, have you ever noticed that when you start giving things away, you keep getting more? In the same way as you empty uh, out, uh, you create a vacuum, nature abhors a vacuum and more flows in. Now, so the question and the puzzle remains. You cannot imitate this thing. There is no way of getting it. And yet it is absolutely essential that we have it. Because obviously the human race is not going to flourish harmoniously unless we are enabled to love each other. But uh, the question is, how do you get it? Is it something you simply have to contract like measles? Uh, or is, as theologians say, is it a gift of divine grace which somehow is dished out to some but not to others? And if there is no way of getting divine grace by anything you do, as the Calvinists aver, then uh, we'd better just sit around and wait until something happens. Although Calvinists never did that. <coughs> they were almost depressingly energetic. <laughs> but surely we can't be left in that kind of a hopeless situation. There must be some way of getting the grace or getting divine charity or love, some sort of wangle, some sort of way in which we can, as it were, open ourselves <clears throat> so as to become conduit pipes for the flow.